What's up guys, this is Sim with Vengeance and I'm back here with another NCAA Football 14 UAB Blazers Dynasty and today your number one UAB Blazers are on the road taking on the number 17 Mississippi State Bulldogs who are 7-1 and, and if you guys are excited for today's video make sure you guys drop a like and if you're new to the channel at all hit that subscribe button down below. So now we're going to take a look at recruiting uh, because we obviously know that this is an important part of what we do here in this dynasty. And uh, if you guys see that this little thing like that I'm touching right here, I, I uh, in the headset. Well, obviously you've noticed the headset for a while, but I've uh, recently had to change a few things in my in my setup, so it's a little different just for now. And I'm moving in a couple weeks, so uh, things are going to be changing a lot. <laughs> so we got Wesley Thompson here. Uh, we got a lead on him now. That's obviously good. The number one quarterback in the country. Uh, he's already got a good passing uh, abilities, so uh, well, where are we at on him? We just took the we're we're gaining progress on him, but it doesn't look like we're getting too much progress. We gotta stay, we gotta beat him out, we gotta blow them out. That's pretty much what I'm trying to say. Um, we've lost Tejon Kemp a little bit, but we got a week 13 visit, and that gives me a little bit of hope uh, to try and sneak in and try and take that guy before it's too late. Uh, obviously, Jermaine Harris, uh, we got us. We got a, we're getting closer to getting him as well. Trey Taylor, we got a lead on him. He's got a week 12 visit. Rashawn Chase, he's got a, uh, he's got, we, we, uh, we almost got it done. The deal is almost done, but I think this is week 10 already. So they're probably going to gain a little bit of traction, but not too much, hopefully. Uh, looks like Jared Wiley's going to be a lock. Um, we're catching up a little bit on Ben Smith. We're catching up, a, we got a lock on Shane Franklin. Brandon Goodman, we've just taken the lead on him. Doesn't look like they got a whole lot there. Uh, we just took the lead on him, though, so it really, really depends. Uh, for everybody else, though, it's eh. I don't want to really unlock the door on a running back that's not really that good. He's got a 91 speed, though. Uh, plus, we already got, like, a bajillion running backs, so I'm, I'm not even going to waste my time. Um, that's just my... That's my humble honest opinion we don't need to spend more time on running backs especially when we have three that are freshmen and they're all really good better just better than him um so take a look at the top 25 and we're gonna see here who's in and who's not um yeah obviously we're number one obviously number two is georgia tech number three iowa number four is oregon number five is texas number six is tulsa Number seven, Oklahoma. Number eight, Clemson. Number nine, Notre Dame. Number 10, California. Uh, number 11 is Navy. Number 12 is Georgia. Number 13 is Miami. Number 14 is Oklahoma State. Number 15 is Houston. At 16 is South Carolina. Number 17, Mississippi State. Number 18, Washington. Number 19, TCU. Number 20 is Auburn after they lost to us last week. Uh, they dropped five spots. Number 21, Boston College. Number 22 is Syracuse. They finally reached the top 25 after however many years in this dynasty. They're 7-0. Number 23 is Maryland. Number 24 is Ohio State at 4-3. I don't know how they're in here. But number 25, rounding it out, is Missouri at 4-3. Other receiving votes, we have Vanderbilt, Nebraska, Stanford, UCLA, Air Force, Virginia Tech, BYU, and Duke. And then Tennessee was the only team that dropped out because they lost to uh, Alabama. Uh, but Alabama still got five losses on the year, so there's no way they're getting back in the top 25 anytime soon. Um, I don't see a five-loss team being anywhere near the top 20. Um, but taking a look here, we do have ourselves a the number one spot. We're fighting for the SEC championship essentially today, guys. Uh, Mississippi State is right behind us, and if we lose to them, it's going to be a whole world of trouble. Uh, Auburn's is right behind us, so is, Al so is Alabama, LSU, T Texas A&M, Arkansas, and Ole Miss have all lost their games within the conference. And um, Georgia, Florida, or Florida, and Tennessee are right behind them. And then you got South Carolina and Vanderbilt, Kentucky, South Alabama, and Missouri rounding out the SEC East. Um, kind of a lopsided SEC, if you ask me. Um, I obviously... Uh, haven't seen much of the SEC this year, um, but it looks like it's been kind of wishy-washy. You don't know what you're going to get any given week in the SEC this year. Um, Justin Kelly, obviously best quarterback in the country, freaking Heisman, top of the Heisman race. Um, 
And then you got Fre uh, Fred Greer, you got Nick Wright, Ty Randall, and uh, Tyler Fagg in the University of Iowa quarterback, who's slipped into the Heisman race. Uh, but Iowa's number three in the country, so who knows we're going to be facing the national championship if we even get there, if we even win this game. Who knows? But... Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this game against Mississippi State. It's going to be a good one. I hope to see you guys on the field. And we are underway here at Davis Wade Stadium as we are about to receive the kickoff, and we're going to let that one go out of the end zone. Screw it. Let me scoot back a little bit here. Let me get myself adjusted, and we'll be ready to go. Well, camera. There we go. <clears throat> All right. Come on, team. Let's make it happen on third. Make it happen. James Hester. Oh, he dropped it. Come on. Dang it. I hate drop passes, man. Ah. Newsflash. This team actually huddles. Like, this is like news. This is this is new stuff to me, man. This team actually uses the huddle. Oh, God. He got burned. Oh, fumble. I think that actually was a fumble this time. I think that actually was a fumble this time. I don't know. I can't tell. If it was, it's a first. If it wasn't, it's a first I down. Them. I I need them to get at least through the pat the pass protection. Going deep. Oh, he's got this. Ah, no, he doesn't. Dang it. We gotta watch out for stuff over the middle. That's why I'm having that spy there, cause he he's he, he needs to be an enforcer over the middle. He needs to be in, his presence needs to be known. And he they went outside. First down. <laughs> And Robert Roth can't cover Let anybody. Let it be known that that Robert Roth can't cover anybody on third down. He can cover everybody else on the first two downs, but not on third. He can't cover anybody today, period. Let's just get out of the way. He can't cover people, period. Send the blitz here on second. This team actually knows how to play football. Oh, come on! Why did you, he literally tripped over another dude before he even got there? Oh, get down. Oh, it's another fumble. Oh, my God. Another fumble. Andy Payne is just disruptive today. He's already being a force. I'll take the field goal. I'll, I'll sit there and I'll take it. It's better than giving up a touchdown. Defense came up big, even though I did not like that possession at all. I'll take it. When I demand pre protection for my quarterback, I don't take that lightly. It's not something that y'all should, should take lightly. I want protection for my quarterback. Oh, there we go. There we go. Aaron Hardy. Oh, my goodness. What a run. Let's go. Follow your blockers and good things happen. Second and six. Frank Clement's going to be wide open. Get that corner first down. Let's go. I called it. See, he ain't gonna cover it twice. He ain't gonna cover it three times in a row. Oh, he's wide open. For Will Davis gets six. Let's go, man. Let's go. That's how we do it here at UAB. Five. Only reason he got five on that last play is because he slid. Quarterback draw. Simple quarterback draw, and he got five because he slid. Oh, get down. Get down. Get down. Right now. Uh-uh. 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 Oh, he's backing off. Slacking. He's slacking. Oh, stay on your feet. Stay on your feet. Ah! <laughs> Touchdown, Frank Clement. Let's go. He was there. Second TD pass. Let's go, man. Third and 17. Andy Payne has been too good on... He's been too good. He's been stopping the run. He's been getting sacks. He's been forcing fumbles. Oh, Brandon Carter almost picked it off. That was a good coverage play right there, man. Good play. All right, let's make it happen on third and five, yo. It's got to happen here. Ain't gonna happen anywhere else, I'll tell you that much. Oh, beautiful catch! Beautiful throw! That's how you do it, man. That is how you do it. Cause now, cause now, it's it's six points here. It's either six points or we're going to face third and seven. 
It's six points. It's six points. Oh, come on. So close. Just didn't get a good enough touch on it. Oh, that's the second TD of the game. Let's go, man. Frank Clement's been a beast. That dumb to try and run into the defense like that. Especially when the protection's already breaking down on him because he's taking too long to throw. Nope, no screen pass here. Oh, that's a nice catch. Nice catch. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Roth, you're killing me. What the frick was that? You talk about getting lucky. They just got it right there. You just let them have that one, Robert. How hard is it for anybody to block? This is why we're at the 14-yard line, because no one on special teams can block. No huddle. Let's go. I feel like I just got served in some injustice. William Davis is wide open again. He's off to the races. <laughs> Timeout. All right, third and goal. 11 seconds. Let's make it happen. All right, fourth and goal. I probably could have ran that one in, but beggars can't be choosers. Whatever. 24-10. They can't handle our man coverage. Brandon Roth is just an idiot. Er, Roth, Mar, er, I don't know what the. I don't even know what to call him anymore. He's just that big of an idiot. He has no awareness. How did he break that tackle? How did he get that first down? I have no idea. He should have never gotten. Wayne Franklin is nine of twelve for one fifty-six because Robert Roth can't cover anybody. Freaking tackle the guy! Come, oh my God! Take him down! What are you doing out here? It's not hard. Here's the problem? I've already figured out your strategy. All you're doing is draw plays. Think you're gonna fool anybody by doing that all all the time? Another draw play? No. Oh, Mueller! Right there, right place, right time. Interception. Not gonna cover that man coverage. Is everyone a more professional type offense so my players are NFL ready to a play block oh up the middle Aaron Hardy first down oh my god Kansas is destroying Texas right now oh my god there's a murder there's a murder happening right now in Texas it is 45 to 13 Kansas <coughs> see we're just gonna run the ball here in the second half like get get Aaron Hardy as much touches as many touches as possible Justin Kelly, off to the races. 24-yard gain. Let's go. No one messes with Justin Kelly. Period. Come on, number 28. Get back in there. Do your thing. Oh, there we go. Get on. Stay on your feet. Let's go. Let's go, number 22. Give it to the big fella. There you go. TJ Marshall, first down. All right, we got to make this play count. Got to make it count, baby. Got to make it count. Oh, where's the interference on that one? Good God. Where is that? There's a dog barking outside, and I want to I want to take its mouth shut. All right, yo. Time to get back on defense and do our thing. Do the work. Oh, he's wide open. What are you doing, Carter? Oh, my God. I've missed him completely. And that's a 75-yard touchdown because Brennan Carter can't cover a freaking thing. For some freaking reason, they're still in this game. They are still in this. I don't know how or why they're still in it. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Zips it to the tight end. Give me that first down. I'm not playing around anymore. These guys need to go away. Being too aggressive, I think I should. I think I should make them pay for being too aggressive. Here they come. Here comes the cavalry. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. 
Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Look at him go! Aaron Hardy for six! Oh no, he can't get it. But we got him. We got him. We got him paying too much attention to number seven. Touchdown. Nope, 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 nope. Oh! Oh! Touchdown for McDaniel! Let's go! Let's go, baby! Four touchdown passes. This game's over. Number nine man. cannot be stopped. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlook. And Carter, way to go, man. You can't cover anybody either. You're just like your boy Robert. Can't cover a damn thing. And that was my fault there. I should have I should have just switched off, but I didn't. Whatever. I hope you guys know this. He's 12 of 16, but is losing the game because of stuff like this. Where he acts like he's a freaking... He has to be the hero. He has to be the hero. He wants doesn't to even look to come back. To, he doesn't even make his, any reads. Nothing. He just wants to be the hero. He wants to be the, the guy who does it all by himself. Oh, get it, get it. you're lucky that wasn't intercepted. You're just lucky it wasn't intercepted. Do I smell another? Whoop! <laughs> That's mine. That is mine. And good luck catching this dude. He is gone. Touchdown! Na 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 na! AJ Patrick for six. Nice. Passing because of fluke plays like that. Because they happen to get a block or happen to get a big play that should have been a turnover. Fluke. He's looking for six. Oh my god. Another one! These guys are the flukiest team I've ever seen! The flukiest! I don't even know if that's even a word! It's, they're flukes! They're a hack! And that is your ball game. Final score, UAB 41, Mississippi State 23. This team's a... Mississippi State's a joke. I'm telling you that right now. I had a bigger challenge facing Colorado and, and other teams than Mississippi State. This team's a joke. But, if you guys enjoyed... Drop a like, look at all the fluke plays, and subscribe if you're new. But until next time, my name is Tim with Ventures. You guys have been amazing as always. Peace out.